I'm Mark. And Sean. And the name of your school, please. Oma CBS. Tell me a little bit about your project. Um, well, our project was olfactory fatigue. It's whenever you cannot, how your nose becomes so used to smell for a period of time that then just becomes used to it and more or less switches itself off. Um, so what we did for our project, we picked four household smells, coffee, cinnamon, lemon and vanilla. And using those scents, we went about um, getting 72 subjects, um, 18 from girls, boys, males and female teachers. And we then just asked them to do these tests where they would smell, take one sniff of each smell and then they would cover it over again so that it wouldn't continuously um, get inhaled by them and they would just say whenever they couldn't smell it. And using those times, we formed averages to say who had better sense of smell and who was then affected more by olfactory fatigue. Okay, fascinating. How, how long have you been working on the project? Well, we applied to be in the competition in October and we found out in the first week of November that we got in and we started from then collecting scents and doing uh, doing tests and work just continuously working up till the up till well the week before the competition. And uh, who chose the subject? Um, initially, I had chosen the subject because um, the title, in fact, um, it was part of a website. But I had just looked at it and I thought that it sounded interesting. And basically, the nose is one that has many problems with it or inabilities about it uh, that so many people ignore. So I just thought it was very interesting and looked into it. So how do, how do your outcomes, the things that you have found through the project, how will you take those forward now that the project's over? Well we, well, we test it between male and female and GCSE and adult level, but we could also make them groups even more refined by dividing the groups into smaller ones, like from a country background and a town background, because people in the country could be exposed to further more sense than ones in the town and that could give varied results and it could be even more detailed to see if your hobbies, if your activities or if your even just your lifestyle does affect your factor as well. And did you find there was a difference in what you, you got from country people and town people? Yeah. They found out that as you progress in age your olfactory gets weaker just like your taste buds do. And we also found out that males have worse olfactory fatigue than females and that could that could be because they could be exposed to more scents. They could it could just be primeval, it could it could just be anything. Sounds like a fascinating subject guys and I'm, you're obviously very passionate about it. Yeah. Well just thought that it was interesting, so many people would find it interesting. Yeah.